the book of John, chapter 8, verse 32. And ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. You see, these days, because of our biblical truth, I now see how to deal with my brother and not have to shed any of his blood in our shared streets because I now know the Most High God has ordained this brother to be a prince. So whenever I look at him, I'm looking at divine royalty. Because of our biblical truth, I now see how to respect my sisters by not speaking of them as objects or treating them like pieces of meat. Because I now know the Most High God has ordained those sisters to be princesses meant to walk righteously alongside of me. You see, we, for too long have allowed these American traditions with illusions of that blasphemous American dream to eradicate our regal heritage for her pagan customs like Halloween, Easter, birthdays, Thanksgiving, and decorating that damn pine cone tree. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't you ever asked why it's only our bodies that drop like flies in these here streets? Well, I'm here to tell my people it's because the Most High God creates that evil. So only he can deliver our peace. Because we were never sent to this wicked ass land to ever prosper. No, we are here to pay for our forefathers' iniquities. So know that none of your vain solutions for our problems will ever solve them. And the proof of that ain't ever been a mystery. And it's all because you still refuse to honor the Most High God, Yahweh, by turning away from your biblical history. <laughs>